I I thought of a, a different approach for this video instead of like get my reaction even though I'm not filming my face because I don't so this video is unprepared so I'm just talking without any scripting or whatever because I usually before I uh, get into the box I want to show you what this video is about so in the uh, story behind it as you can see Dr. Pan I got this shirt recently it's a it's a good shirt but here's the Dalek and this is an Asylum Matt Smith era Dalek and uh, so this is the Asylum Dalek and it is very small not as big but I got it because it was like something I can get for the sake of it and not get like $50 for a little thing or something like that so I got this for like $18 if I remember correctly I'm not too sure it's really small but it's worth it because there's a lot of detail I think it's made by yeah character options I love it but the thing is it is so small and, the, and some of the articulation is a bit loose here and there it's hard it's difficult to do stop motion animation with this anyway but I got there in the end now I went on eBay and I've been mean, it took like I think two years that I decided to get an actual big Dalek instead of a tiny one because I remember seeing when I was in 2017 I think so I went to the markets and looked for really antique stuff on that and I came across a huge huge Dalek but it's like um, I can't remember if it was wood or plastic and it was absolutely knackered it wasn't in good shape whatsoever there was pieces missing and I didn't get it because at the time I was really eager saving money for something that's actually really cool there so I did so I got that gas mask that I, I did a video on before I kept searching for a big doll because I really wanted to get something that's massive instead of something that's small like this for instance and and I'm a big fan of the classic era um, I think I watch that more than the new series not, not to say that the new series is bad I love the new series and I love it where it's going right now. I think I'll make a video on that later in the, in the future. So I went on eBay and I saw this big Dalek and I thought it was a decent size. And it's a remote control Dalek. And it's the classic era Dalek. I don't know what type it is. Yeah, so here's the box, and it is pretty. Uh, what was I gonna say? Yeah, pretty massive. And I covered the label up because I had to redo this video because I forgot to put stupid paper on so I don't see my address. Well, it's not really a big deal because my parents they work at Itology, so they fix phones and stuff in in this house. So. If you do see that, um, it's not a big deal because people come to our house and they get their phones fixed anyway. So I always thought about that. In some cases where I do have box showing my address or possibly someone else's, I'm not too sure. So just so you know, if that's the case or not. And if it is, she'll do something about the video in the other unboxing videos that you see here. Stupendously. Okay. Here we go. Yes, it is it. Oh my goodness. Okay.
It is a mess. There's so much for this. Oh my god, this is so heavy. It's this or my. This is a. Ah, there's a bit of foam here to prevent the. Yeah, this. Oh my god. Alright, um. Yeah. So I don't want to damage it because it is. This. This uh, Dalek was made when I was born. Was, uh, the year when I was born, in 2002, not the date, but. I'm not too sure of the date of this being made and this is not like something that you can order like just in any way because this is like a, a rare item so I don't know how from what I've remembered seeing this is in good condition and I don't know how good it is oh my god holy crap this is this is great oh my god gotta be careful man here's the remote and I hope this works. I've seen some of this in the video a couple of times. I'm gonna, I'm gonna clean this up. Hang on a second. Now, I changed the camera angles to give you a better look at the thing. And it is so big. Big. Actually, first of all, we'll look at the remote. We'll move on to this later. Mm. Now, the other person, the person that that had this, and I ordered it from, he had another one, and it wasn't as good as this good condition compared to this. And uh, if I remember correctly, that one was only for display purposes only, so it wasn't. That's what the guy mentioned in his. It's, it's been bad enough quite a bit. Man, I love that. I love the embossing of the classic Dalek. Now, this, if I remember correctly, this the company that made these, you can't get these anymore because these, the company that made these are no longer available. So this is genuinely rare and worth quite a lot of money because it's pretty cool. And it's my favorite color. I love purple, I love red. I could use scissors, but that would make things worse. Cause it's coming up. And... Oh no, some of it broke. Really, man? Oh wait, that's yeah. I remember quickly now. This didn't. This didn't come with uh, the plunger thing that Daleks had. This was like that in the first so I'm thinking I might I could make my own have this the right scale and size or I can order one but those are really expensive so I gotta I'll, I'll find out I'll do another update video not now but another time dude it's it's incredibly good condition for for how people that so awesome man I'm, I'm out of breath I'm, well, I'm not out of breath but I don't know what to say really I was skeptical that if this was the, the item or not now it is Oh yeah, it didn't come with a flap. I could make my own flap for that, so. It's all nice and polished down the front, but there is some dusty, dust, dusty. So you gotta be careful with articulation, especially with old toys. Compared to, this is not a good comparison because this is an old classic version of the Dalek, and this is like a new version, but Compare the size, not the error of the Dalek. You can see, very tiny, big, but worth the size. Because sometimes they're really big is better. Now, I hope this doesn't wreck it, but 
from what I'm from what I've seen so far. Now I don't know when it's turned on and it actually works with the lights that light up. Apparently, when you move it around, the head will rotate, and this will move. Now, if you see that little tat there. I'm not sure if that's gonna wreck the tronics. I'm just gonna leave it. I really like that, it's really neat. Now, I replaced the batteries. Uh, brand new batteries, because we didn't have any of the batteries we needed for this beautiful specimen. And uh, then we'll put some new batteries in, and let's see what this bad boy can do. Now, I'm amazed that this, the remote control Dalek made by um, Product Inter Enterprise, this one has got to be the most amazingly good conditions I have ever seen. This guy, I've seen a lot of these guys, they don't work. Like the head movement, the time the remote doesn't work, lights don't work, the sound chips don't work. This is phenomenal because most of the videos I've seen where these guys don't work and I've only seen what they look like in the old ad commercial. Never saw it in television, but I saw it on YouTube. And um, so it goes beautifully. And you can you can hear the sound is a bit etchy here and there, but. Just goes to show how old it is. You know, it's so loud. As for turning. Yeah, you can see really well it doesn't work on carpet this is not um, smooth enough and yeah so yeah I'm not gonna do this this is just a test distant future I will probably do an update on uh, get the plunger because this didn't come with the plunger it was broken off with on e in eBay the way I got it and I might make a tab piece at the end back flap I recall them because it never came on as well. And you can see these wheels don't are not meant to be those are the type of wheels that are not meant to be for carpet yet. Yeah. So I am so pleased with this.